Hey guys, <clears throat> welcome to another video. Today's it, today's video is gonna be um, natural disasters number. You know, I've actually lost track. But yeah, today we found a tornado that was an EF four. Still can't find an EF five, but this is the closest I can get, or second closest. But we're gonna try to find this tornado, and we're gonna drive into it. But I have a rule. If if the tornado is more than 170 miles per hour, then I'll record it. And then <clears throat> if it's more than 200, I'll definitely record it because... <gasps> mm, yeah. Um, there goes my car. So, yeah. It's, it's, it's like my car's dead. So, we're going to drive into it again. Hopefully my car doesn't die. <clears throat> And I'm showing the. I'm also showing this video to show tornadoes can cause damage in real life. If you ever encounter a tornado, make sure to go in a basement. You know, that's the best thing to do because reasons. And now the tornado's fleeing me, and I can't get out, and it's gonna kill me. So, yeah. But you know, I just wanted to record this video to show you. In EF4. Too bad you guys can't see it because it's nighttime. Nighttime tornadoes are actually the worst type because they're at night and you can't see them. So, yeah. But if you guys enjoyed this video, a short video, this is a short video. Um, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll make sure to see you guys in the next video. Also, if you ever see an EF4 or an EF5, um, and if you don't know what, what EFs are, here is right here. You can see EF0 wind damage is 65 to 85 miles per hour, which is a lot for, on, on my standards. The EF1s are 80 or 86 to 110 miles per hour, and over 100, pretty powerful. EF2s are 111 to 115. I also think that's pretty big because I've never experienced a tornado in my life because I live in a desert and it's in surrounded by mountains because I'm in a valley. Um, then there's an EF3, which is EF2s to EF3s are actually average. And the reason because the reason is um, e tornadoes don't weaken uh, in this game or Twister County. They don't weaken. For, they don't weaken at EF zeros or EF ones. But it, there is a slight chance that it might weaken at an EF one. Then there's EF four, which is 166 to 199, which is powerful, like extra powerful. And if you're wondering why the screen is like red, because it says no power, and then there's a like weird siren thing at the top. And then there's an EF5 200 plus. So if you see a tornado that's 166 to over 200, then make sure to tell me because I, I want to know what tornado you guys have seen. And yeah. If you guys enjoyed this kind of short video, make sure to give a like, make sure to comment, and subscribe to my channel. Well, it's optional, because at least half of you are subscribed to me. Half of you that watch me are subscribed to me, but that's that doesn't really matter, because subscribe. you know, the viewers you get along the way, like I said, are more important than subscribers. I know, a lot of people think that subscribers are more important than the viewers you get along the way. And it's it's not really that true. But, uh, getting off topic, um, yeah. Here, this tornado, EF4, and it, I'm showing that EF4s in this game actually do damage to your car, one when in contact. So, like, so for example, if there's an EF1, and it fling it flings you, but it doesn't do it doesn't do anything. Um, it doesn't do anything to your car because it's not powerful enough. If you encounter an EF four or an EF five, then you might be able to experience your car that looks like this. 
and I'll get out of my car and even show it. Your car might look like this if it's an EF4 or an EF5 tornado and you drive inside of it. And, you know, and same thing goes in real life, except EF1s can do damage to your car, windows, debris, you know, stuff, because tornadoes are a serious thing in your life, you know. And if you live in a tornado alley, then stay safe because staying safe is the most important thing. All right. But if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to give it a like, make sure to comment, and optional subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video, which I don't know when. I, I'm My uploads are kind of wonky. I upload at random times, so make sure to turn on notifications and stay tuned for anything, any video that I put up. And I might do a live stream if I can, because 1,000 subscribers, you need that to live stream, I'm pretty sure. Um, but yeah, you know, if you enjoyed, make sure to give a like and comment. And wait, I said, I said, I said, I said, like, comment and subscribe, like, 10 times, so I'm not saying it again. Make sure to, no, I I was about to say it again. Sorry, this thing, I'm, we're getting so off topic. But hope you enjoyed this video. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.